case here I have some pot rivets which actually have a thread on them which as you can see here these are M3 I'm trying to go for the smallest that I can use I'm then going to incorporate some hooks which are threaded which will go around the bow of the tailgate, tail of the tailgate and obviously this is just curtain flex which you can buy on eBay etc. I bought five meters. You're going to need a few drill sizes which I will explain as we go further along. This is obviously the tool for doing these pot rivets. You're going to need a drill And as we screw fitted four around the door card. So now what I always want to check is that the actual hooks fit in there. I really want these quite strong. So you want a little bit of tension on this, so I'm going to pull it quite tight. This is the reason why I wanted these um, screw things actually screwed in, because anything else with the tension, it's a good chance it would have just pulled out. Come on. I'm going to put a hook on one end and a full loop on the other. And then we simply pull these to join them and there you go you have quite a tight shower rail I bought these hence why these carabiners come in you can imagine these will be hooked to the shower curtain and we can just simply latch them on okay so that's the shower attached nicely attached to the rail as you come round I put Velcro down the front here to give you a, some privacy as well. And the shower setup is a bucket. He's fed on the bucket. This is a great little shower. You can just pull the top out, turn it on and off. And the shower will give you about 60 minutes on a full charge. <coughs> and the shower with this bucket, such as the actual bucket we have here, is about two minutes shower. So there you have it.